G'day, thanks for joining us for Saturday Afternoon Football. Anthony Hudson here, broadcasting live. Today, we are at GMHBA Stadium. Pretty warm day here for footy. Providing special comments for today's game is Gary Lyon. Hi, Hutto. Always a pleasure. Today's match between Geelong and the Magpies... They run on in full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. It's a big day for the Collingwood defenders. They can stop Geelong from being dominant inside 50. They've got a big chance to win this. Geelong run onto the ground. We are Geelong, the, greatest team of all. the banners are ready for the players. We play the game as it should be played. The captains make their way to the middle for the toss. The Cats kicking to the right of screen. Round eight. We're just moments away from the opening bounce. And here we go, it's Geelong taking on Collingwood. Lobs the handball. Morrison hacking it out of there. Ball ends up with Livingston. Just got the hands in the back there. Takes that one strongly. Gourlay tucks it into the pocket. Livingston marks in a bit of space. Picked off by Stratton. Higgins with the ball. With the ball now. It's a turnover. Slice slams it onto the boot. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Kicks it long. Good grab there from Davey. With quick hands, Gourlay has the ball. It's cut off by T. Links with hands. Boy gets a quick kick away. Ball picked up. She can put it through. Drop punt straight through the middle. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around Morrison. The first goal going to the Cats. Winning it was Boyd. Just manufactures what she could. Dug out the loose ball. T just threw it. Looks up with the kick. Over the top of the pack. Wants to keep it moving. Tries to release the pressure. She's got the football now. Picks up the loose ball. Going for goal number one. Did it carry? I think it's a goal. She's excited about that one. Collingwood sink there first. Center bounce. Darcy just slaps it down. Didn't get low enough with the tackle. Chips it towards half forward. Doing well to intercept that kick. Brazil puts it on the boot. Gets the loose ball. Giving it off with Lambert. Davy links with a teammate who can run, applying the physical pressure. Skinner on the ball. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Keeps moving. Takes the mark all by herself. 35 metres out. This shot should be elementary from here. Purcell whacks one on the boot for goal. Geelong are happy about that one. That's her first. The teammates rush over. 
The margin is six. The game is back underway. Cranston hurls it away. Bit too casual with the tackle. Allen links up with a chance to run. Finds the loose ball. Gets a touch to the ball. Finding the ball was Malloy. Puts it on the boot. Membry gets the loose ball. Ball hits the deck. Let him up, well, well. The umpire will ball it up. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. Higgins with the mark. Going for goal number one. Nurses that ball through the big sticks. Yes, I know. Higgins loves that goal. Geelong have kicked back-to-back -back goals. Geelong by two goals. Slapped away. The loose ball picked up. Clears the congestion. O'Connor cuts it off. The umpire calls for a stoppage. Malloy gets it down. Ivy collects it. The ball mopped up. Thank you, I'll have it. Malloy does well. The loose ball scooped up. Looking to kick. Goal number two. Collingwood finds a way to get that one through. They get a rounder after that effort. Collingwood keeping in touch. Back in the middle. One down. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. The kick from Cranston. Right. Leaps over the top. Got the hands free. McWilliams able to release the kick. Good mark. There's the siren for the end of the quarter. The scores are Geelong 18 to Collingwood 12. Geelong grew up and about early, and I bet the coach would be happy with this lead at quarter time. Here's Gaz to break down the stats. Collingwood are playing a very controlling game. They're taking plenty of marks and denying the opposition possession. Much appreciated, Gaz. We're ready for second quarter action. About to resume play. Big thump from Boyd. Allen uses the bump. Hits the target by hand. Couldn't complete the mark. They can create from this. With the ball is Cranston. Unbelievable. And they put it through. Gets her first. She acknowledges the crowd. Geelong lead by two goals. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. It's great to watch her. Though. Plenty of excitement. We're back in the middle now. Boy with the punch. Has it now. O'Day collects the loose ball. Sweeping handball. Going for goal number one. Davy delivers with a straight drop punt. She loved that one. Collingwood now only trail by six. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Geelong getting plenty of possessions at the moment. Back in the middle as the rucks go at it. Thump clear. She gains the possession. She's got the footy in her hands. T couldn't keep her hands on it. Mops up the loose ball. Sends it clear of the contest. Boy takes the mark. 
chose to kick it, taking a nice grab. Uses it across half back. Rushes with the kick. Marks all the line. Lynch spears the ball. Good mark by Darcy. At full stride, receives the handball. Fans off the tackler. Interesting handball. Intercepted. I can tell already that's not too good. She looks injured. Gary, what do you think it is? Yeah, definitely something wrong here. She's trying to get off the ground as quick as she can. Look at them celebrate that effort. That's two in a row for Collingwood. We're all tied up now. Just threw the ball. Moves the ball by foot. Alexander presents and takes the mark. 45 metres out. Move it on. Going for goal number one. That's something to smile about. Get some reward for her efforts. Collingwood for ticks. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. The Magpies are getting themselves into the right spots at the moment. And they're cutting off these opposition kicks. Umpire ready to resume play. Punches are clear. Practicing some fancy moves. Brown takes it well. Got boot to ball. Pushing the back. He gives away a free for in the back. Uses it across half back. Strong mark in the contest. Puts boot to ball. And the mark will be paid. Moves it by foot. Easily takes the mark. Brown pops to play on. Rowe doesn't take the mark. Her first possession. Gathers it now. Had the pressure bearing down. Awkwardly got the handball out. She can take off after that handball. A chance to put a second goal on the ball. Oh, what about that? That was really special. Pretty happy with that one. Two-goal lead for Collingwood. Back in the middle to resume play. Thrashes it. She has the ball. A great defensive effort. Davy slick with the hands. Purcell is streaming past and gets the footy. Clark takes a strong mark. Handballs to no one in particular. McDonald running off for a break. We'll have another ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Punched away. Rowe rushes with the kick. Does well to cut off the kick. Sinks the slipper into it. Finds a target. Decides to kick. Great grab. Shevlin uses it by foot. Membry there to mop up. Hurry kick. High marks. Goes with the kick. Nice hands. Alexander kicks it. A big contested grab. Advantage. Slap. The siren sounds, and that's the end of the term. The scores. Collingwood 36, Geelong 24. It's been a promising first half for Collingwood. They'd be confident they can keep it going in the second half. Any thoughts from you, Gaz? Collingwood have been extremely well organised at the stoppages and it sees them being able to win the ball from the clearance. Thanks for that, Gaz. Both sides taking a much-needed rest at the long break. The second half just moments away. The third quarter has begun. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Is in her possession. Opportunity for Allen. Skinner controlling the airwaves on this occasion. She doesn't want to let her teammates down with this shot at goal. She decides to go for home. Oh, what a goal! 
smiles all round. Just under two goals the difference now. Thumps it clear. Davy keeps coming. Showing some really good pressure there. Takes possession. She can't hold the mark. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She needs to find a way into this game. Sheridan won herself a free. She drives it towards goal. Roberts got under it. Normally a pretty good kick. Let's see what she can do here. Ten metres out. Move it on. What a fantastic goal. Roberts enjoying that goal. Two goals the margin for Collingwood. Back with another centre bounce. Swats it. Using every ounce of energy she has left. Putting her skills on display. The handball hits the target. Skinner now. They can link up now. That looked great. What a goal. She sinks her first goal. Celebrating hard. Geelong close the gap to Tix. About to resume hostilities. Clears the contest. Ivy got her high there. Alex to kick. Darby found a way to mark that one. Darby has resources out wide. Purcell tries to gain some territory. Handballs out into space, trying to avoid everything out there. Releases by hand. Allen can't hold on to the tackle. This is Darby. Slicer is blowing hard after that effort. Fights the good fight with a driving kick. An easy grab for Darcy. Looks to move it by foot. A great mark taken there. Dishes it off. Handball finds Brazel. That tackle just too high. Brazel goes with the kick. Taylor flew high but didn't hold on. Darby picks up the loose ball. Stratton dug out the loose ball. Picked up now. Doing well was Slicer. The ball kept alive. Couldn't go on with it. And the ball goes out. Membry making her way onto the field. The players will be feeling the heat right now. Ball back into play. Hammers it. Scoops up the ball. Gourlay throws the ball away. O'Connor sends one up towards the wing. McMahon drives the kick. It's a foot race to get this one. Picked off the deck. Goes short by hand. She gets her hands on the footy. Roberts continues to dominate this contest. She's the most dominant player on the ground at the moment. A clean pickup. Picks it up. She likes her chances from here. Offline for a behind. Collingwood by seven points. Brown weighing up the options now. Right, gets in a good position. Goes by foot. Open opportunity for McDonald. Uses it now. McWilliam takes the mark. Channels a long kick. She gives chase to the footy. Darcy gathers it now. Use the hands and gives away the free. Moved on by Shevlin. A strong mark in the pack from Gourlay. Collingwood are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Uses it by foot. Nice mark under pressure. Slams it on the boot. She finds herself in space and marks. Kick by McMahon. Geelong with a lot to think about. They trail by seven. Collingwood walk into three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game. Plenty of scoring opportunities in the third term. It'll be interesting to see which team can capitalise in the final quarter.
Brooke Williams having an impact right now. She's having a fantastic game. Let's see what this last quarter throws up. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. Thump by Boyd. Oh, Dave! Grabbed it clean. What are you... Ball up in the centre square. A critical stage of this one. Hammers it. Didn't fumble. Scoops it up. Oh, Dave! Dug it out. Looks like the ball will be coming back. O'Connor collects the kick. The umpire pings her here. Got boot to ball. A chance to reload the attack now. With a driving kick. Morrison wins the marking contest. Goes with the kick. Boyd struggling to run at the moment. Collected by Higgins. Has to do better in that mark contest. Higgins looks to build some momentum with this kick. Going for goal number two. Sometimes you just sit back and enjoy the show. Congratulated by her teammates. The Cats have kicked the last two goals. They are right back in this now. Cranston just swats it away. Davey finds possession. A bit too hard with a push, and it's a free kick. Davey pushes a low ball. Hacking it out of there. Hines grabs that one. She spears the ball. Intercepts the ball very well. McDonald moves it now. McWilliams runs after this one. I'll have it. Punched away. Collects the loose ball. No prior. And we'll get a ball up. It's very tense at the moment. Boy won the hit out. Thank you. The umpire calls for it. Punches it clear. Picked up under pressure. Does well to keep it in play. Slick with the hands. Wins the race to the ball. T throws the ball away. Alex to kick. Malloy takes the mark uncontested. A chance for Lambert. That goal is a cracker. Look at her. She really enjoyed that one. Collingwood by seven points. We resume hostilities. Cranston with the hit. Dug it out. We'll get a ball up. Cranston thumps it forward. Clark was taken high in the tackle. Looks to move it by foot. Ends up turning this ball over. Darcy sends one up towards the wing. Winning the ball in the air was Venici. Moves it by foot. A chance to gather the ball. Fighting hard was O'Connor. She has the ball. Finding the loose ball was Cranston. Off hands. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Yeah, she's barely touched the ball, Hunter. And the umpire will ball it up. Boyd thumped it clear. She just throws that ball. Boyd drives the kick. Hickey over the top. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Go. Going for goal number one. Marks now and can send it back. Allen kicks hard along the boundary line. Moves it quickly. Gawley getting in on the act. Linking by hand. 
Ends up with Stratton. Hickey kicks hurriedly. Finds a bit of room to mark. 45 metres out. Going for goal number one. No issues with that drop punt. She's enjoying that goal. This game is still alive. And we're back in motion. Thrashes it. An incredible victory. They were down at one stage and rallied and fought back to win. What stood out for you today, Gas? We always look to see our side to respond when challenged. And the response from Collingwood was first class and they proved themselves the better side. Thanks, Gaz. At the end of the match, Collingwood defeated Geelong 49 to 48. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. Thanks, Hanno. I've enjoyed every minute of it.